Hey guys and welcome back to WebView, to my WebView tutorial, and this is part two. So now what we're gonna be doing today? Oops, sorry. What we're we, what we're gonna do in this one is have we need to go into our main storyboard, and what we're gonna do is put a text field right here where you can type in your text, and then it loads it up. It loads up a web. It loads up your URL that you typed. So first, we need to make our web view a little smaller, and then type in. Uh, oh no, then we need to bring in a text field. Sorry, text field. Let's make it spelled that big. There we go. Now our Button is gonna be go. There we go. Okay, so now what I'm gonna type. Oh, you know what? I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so go into our viewcontroller.h and then we need to select this and control drag again. No, not again. And then we just type in text field field. Actually, I'm just going to name this URL field. URL field. Okay. Now, uh, select your go button. And then, you need to make this an action. And then type in go. Okay, so once again, all of our coding is done in there. We controller.h. Now we need to go to our controller.m. Okay, so, what we do first off here... It's j j just above our coding last time. We type in uh, U R. Oh wait, no, we need us. We need to synthesize our um, URL field. URL field. So now we need to type in URL field dot text equals at and then the string and then HTTP slash slash colon slash slash and then now what we type in is uh, URL field set delegate self okay so what we're doing here is making the text on our oops on our uh, URL field like our uh, text text field when the user is going to type in their uh, the address, making that a this right here, and so then self. Oh wait, no, hold on. URL field dot delegate delegate self. Okay, then I guess we don't need this then. Okay, so we have the, our coding right here. Making the URL, the URL request, loading the request. So now what we type in here is basically the same thing. Okay, so what we do is first we type in nsurl equal, oh, we need to name it, uh, URL equal space bracket um n s url url with string then bracket url field text and close up the brackets now what we type in is n s url re oops url request then name it url request like last time bracket uh n s url request Request with URL, URL. Okay, then um, right here we type in then web view load request, and then we type in URL request. Okay, now we just need to type in a bool statement. 
So do dash bool and type in text. Oh, first, oh yeah, I forgot. Now view controller dot h we need to come here right next to the view controller and type in the caret sign then UI text field delegate. There we go. Now yeah, now I think this part will work. Uh URL field set delegate self. Yep. That's what it was. Okay. So now we type in text field should return and what we're ooh hold on let's have to see it. Oh it's a bool. Hold on. Okay, so text field should return. <coughs> Sorry. And then return yes. And then what we need to type in right here it, just above it is URL field resign first responder. And that should be error free. Okay, so let's command S and then run. Project on the simulator. Let this load up. There, you see this? So now we're not going to delete that text, so I'm just going to type in youtube.com. Go. Now I'm just going to press return. See how it loads up? Okay. So, yeah, guys, that's it. Thank you for watching. Oh, and remember to visit my. Uh, mobile development blog for tips and tutorials and here I'll type in the link at blog.wordpress.com there we go so remember to visit my site thanks for watching guys